Hello. So we've been talking about the use of power transistors in the design of um, power output stages or power amplifiers. And as a quick final note, I just wanted to point out that if we look at the data sheet for a power transistor versus a small signal transistor, uh, we're going to find different values for some uh, key parameters, key characteristics. And so I've added this table here to try to illustrate some of those differences. Uh, the first table compares a small signal BJT to a power BJT, as far as uh, a couple of those parameters. And then the second table compares a small signal MOSFET to a power MOSFET. Now, uh, it needs to be understood that these are just for purposes of illustration, obviously within the small signal family of transistors and the power uh, family of transistors, there's going to be some variation from transistor to transistor in the values of these parameters. But these are parameters that we expect will have uh, significantly different values for a small signal transistor versus a power transistor. So let's compare the uh, small signal BJT 2N2222 to the 2N3055, which is a power BJT. And if we look at the data sheet, we will see uh, in the AppsMax table that the maximum VCE listed for the small signal transistor is 40 volts, whereas for the 2N3055 is 60 volts. And it's actually um, towards the lower end of the range for a power transistor. Uh, they can be several hundreds of volts sometimes for power transistors. The maximum collector current is listed as 800 milliamps for a small signal transistor versus 15 amps for that uh, particular power transistor, so um, a huge difference. Maximum power dissipation also we expect uh, for the small signal transistor is 1.2 watts, which is actually pretty good for a small signal transistor. For the power transistor in question is 115 watts, which is um, it's pretty high even for a power transistor. Uh, and then there are other parameters that are typically going to be lower for power transistors, um, as we often have these trade-offs when we are designing circuits. And those are going to be uh, the value of beta, the current gain of the transistor. Notice that um, it's in the range of 35 to 100 for the 2N2222. Uh, sometimes it goes all the way to 300 for a small signal transistor. And for this power transistor, it's between 5 and 20. So um, much lower. And then the uh, unity gain frequency or the small signal bandwidth, it's around 300 megahertz for this small signal transistor, around uh, 0.8 megahertz for the power transistor. So typically lower as well for a power transistor. In the case of the MOSFET transistors, we can also compare a small signal MOSFET, the 2N7000, with a power MOSFET, the 2N6757 in this case. And um, as we expect, the uh, drain to source voltage maximum is going to be higher for the power MOSFET, 150 volts versus 60 volts for the small signal one. The maximum drain current is 200 milliamps for the small signal MOSFET versus 8 amps for the power MOSFET. And the maximum power dissipation, 350 milliwatts versus 75 watts. Um, so again, no surprises here. Those are just the... Uh, parameters that are directly related to uh, power performance.